Diane is a 38-year-old woman who has extensive scar tissue resulting from a prior breast surgery, making it especially difficult for a physician to accurately interpret her mammograms. When I had my uh, breast reduction done 11 years ago, I have um, scarring and scar tissue all along the baseline and uh, up the middle and around the nipple. And I, they also left me with uh, numerous staples. So even getting a mammogram for me is very uncomfortable. Not to mention, you know, it, it's very hard for them to read because they've got the scar tissue and they've got the staples to have to deal with. During a routine mammogram, Diane's physician discovered a highly suspicious lump in her left breast. He recommended a biopsy be performed. Then the long process of waiting and uncertainty began. From the time that uh, I found out that there was an abnormality and that they felt that I possibly had breast cancer until the time that I had the biopsy or the scheduled biopsy, it was five, it, there was five weeks in there where we were kind of living through a living hell of not knowing and, and trying to decide, you know, wills and, you know, worst case scenarios. It was, it was very, it was a very difficult five weeks. Diane's physician told her about BSGI, and she was willing to travel outside her area to end the uncertainty. By having this test done, uh, we found out within like 20 minutes that I, I did not have cancer. And if, if this would have been available in my area, we would have been able to have this done within days of the initial first mammogram. And the way that it ended up working out is we ended up having to wait for five weeks by the time that it was even introduced to me. The test was fast, it was safe, it was effective. We knew right away that I didn't have cancer. And in, in having that done and knowing right away that I didn't have cancer, it, it's also saved me from having an unnecessary biopsy. You have a biopsy and you get a preliminary result, but you still have to wait to find out if it's cancer or not or how aggressive it is. This way, you know right now that you don't have, you either do have something there or you don't. I would definitely recommend the machine and the, the procedure. Um, it's non-invasive, it's, it's, not, it's not uncomfortable, it, uh, and, and the accuracy rate, I mean, it's, it, it can actually give you the peace of mind that uh, you don't always get from a mammogram.